Hey everyone, Jastefer here with my second haul for November 2016. It's a large box. It doesn't hardly fit in the camera. Let's open it up and see what's inside. I believe that this is from Lego Shop at Home. Just like most of these are. Couldn't find my good pair of scissors, so I had to find a pair of scissors looks just as bad as old as I am so this might be a long unboxing oh, maybe not okay are there any receipts in? let me pull it out I always get questions asked why I don't like showing my personal information it's just due to privacy I see receipts hold on I'm not going to ruin the surprise. I'm just pulling out all the papers. Any more papers in there? Okay. Okay, so... I got the usual pop. Things I like to pop on. Sometimes you give these to the dogs and they like tearing them up too. Okay, let's take a look and see what's inside. I did order this... Santa thing set number four zero two zero five. The lighting in here is not that good. This must be the freebie, the toy soldier. Doesn't even have a, a set number on it. I actually splurged and got one of these ornament things with the gold bricks. Look how gold those look. Those look pretty cool. I want to see if those were worth their value. And I finally got the Christmas train. I'm ordering the rest of the power functions. They're on back order. So yeah, let's make sure there's no surprises underneath the bottom. Okay, we're good. We can pull that out. Now, honestly, guys and gals, I know somebody's going to say the camera got hit. Yeah, I'm in a very small area right now. My Lego room is cramped with boxes, a lot of it which I don't want to show right now. So, this is my first train set I've ever gotten Lego. Trains were pricey back when I was a kid and never got a hold of one. And this box looks like it's obviously slightly dipped in and crushed. Not sure if this happens in transit or happens in packaging. I would have to say in transit. And I had a comment, somebody said I staged these. I wish, because some of these boxes I do save so I don't damage my own boxes. So I decided to get the winter holiday train, seeing it's my very first train set. Looks like a fun build. I will be doing an extensive review on that with the power functions. And I'm already disappointed. It doesn't come with any straight tracks. So, 52 centimeters or 20 inches. 20 inches, really? It's about the width of this table. <laughs> really small. This was a hundred dollars, I believe. I hope I'm not going to get disappointed with the train. So that's the toy soldier. I don't have any gold bricks like this. These are like it's mostly full of dark tan, gold, and transparent yellow. Pretty cool assortment. We'll be doing a walkthrough on that too. Holiday reviews are always fun to do. Looks like you can write your name right there if you wanted to on that. So this is the Santa's workshop. Maybe with elves or something. I don't know. It didn't have a name on it so I don't remember. Let's look at the receipt and see what it actually is. 
Okay, it's called the Little Elf Helpers. So it has a name. Well, that's the little hall right now. That's that's it. I have a couple more halls that are back ordered. Uh, I've been getting tons and tons and tons of questions asked. When's the next Lego room tour? I have posted that a dozen times on Twitter as well as talked about it in my live chat. So I'll leave that up for you guys and gals to visit Twitter. It's at Jastifer. I encourage everyone to follow me on Twitter. I post a lot of stuff. Pretty much if I'm working on something, it gets posted on Twitter. So if you're not following me on Twitter, <laughs> you're missing out. You're missing out a pretty good chunk of the story. Also follow me on Instagram. It's at Jastifer. Visit my website, jastifer.com. Everything is Jastifer. You can even do a Google search and you'll find everything. You can even go to the bottom of the description and it has all the links posted there for you too for your convenience. Now I asked this question on Facebook but I'm going to ask it here. What do you guys think of the new parts list on the uh, travel trailer? I decided to put it on my website because it overflowed YouTube's box. They only allow 5,000 characters. So I decided to put it on my website and I'm starting to slowly map links to BrickLink I want to know what you guys and gals think. Do you like the parts map to BrickLink? Give me your input on that. I really would appreciate it. So this is the second haul for November 2016. There will be many more hauls coming soon. Thank you for watching.